Everybody pray for me. It's been a day for me. Yeah, yeah. Cold. Loading up to 72. You got that? You hold it for real quick? <laughs> Luggage. Thought you said this thing. <laughs> hey, what are we doing, bro? What are we doing? What are we doing here? <laughs> Come on. Why are we unloading your bike? <laughs> Why are we unloading it? We gotta get another one. <laughs> yes. <laughs> bye bye S. Chuck is picking up another bike today. Um, we'll show you. We'll show you more on it here in a second. We can go grab it. But another Elite S. Um, I believe from the pictures, this one has the the Japan headset on it too. But um, you guys will see. So the, this is a frame that you gave me. Huh? So that yeah. if I was to give you the paperwork, the fuck you think would have the frame that I have? In the yeah, another one. That would be cool. But it's got the Koso piece. It does, yeah. It's got a Kosa. <laughs> might have to go to you, huh? Actually, a real one, huh? Imagine that one chrome. I think that one, it might not be. Look at it right here. It might. Oh, it might have been made. Might be made. I'm gonna have to do that. It's possible. I'm gonna have to do that for sure and chrome it. What you thinking, bro? What carb is yeah. this? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Get the center stand. Center stand. Fuck, I really don't like get rid of him. Cause off to his house because he live on the south side, yo. Yeah. yeah, this is the one, the, the bins to the, the paperwork. I'll go grab the paperwork in the house. And you still get the the, the side cover? The, the Everything's all on top here. Oh, okay, okay, cool, cool. You taking this frame too? Yeah, we're taking this. Because this is the frame that he, the that's original. Only, yeah. This that's front so end's a little bust. Yeah. That's why we, he bought this one because it's crashed and it's not straight. So like what's where is it bent at? We gotta look at it somewhere on the forks, I bet. Or, who knows if the frame might be okay too. Not only another elite, but also another elite frame <sighs> with all the plastics. I think too. He has all the plastics for it. Another one, huh? Yes, sir. What's the plans of this one? Uh, Too complicated. This is going to be the cruiser. I'm going to retire the black one, build another motor for that, and make this the wheelie machine so I don't fuck up the other one. This one's got 72 already in it, right? Yeah. It's PG long pipe? Already in it. it doesn't even stamp PG on it, though. It's PG. It is PG? Yeah, it just doesn't have. Oh, shit. It's PG. Time to clean this bugger up, though. You got to get clean and son. Do Look I at this. Look you got to get to clean and. Sideway license I like that grab bar. Yeah, I don't care. 28 mil carb. Gonky boy. Look inside that thing. Sheesh. Look at that Koso. <laughs> you want that Koso? <laughs> yeah, I don't care. 28 mil carb. Gonky boy. Look inside that thing. Sheesh. Look at that Koso. <laughs> you want that Koso? <laughs> Dude, that one has an angle to it. You that see one it? Has, yeah, that one's like a stock one. Yeah. That one's interesting. So, I'm probably gonna put that trans on my black bike when I go. Really swap it all over? Yeah. <laughs> Why? Because I, I like how it runs with the S trans better, honestly. You get a picture? Yup. <laughs> Another one. Another one. Another one. <laughs> 72 kit. Do you know what 72 kit's in it? Lenny Corsa. No way. It's the mm -hmm. Corsa. Ported. Ported? Yeah. Yups. Was it pretty fast when you were riding it? This thing was fast when when I first had my Melosi kit. He spanked me. Yeah. So this was actually Chuck's scooter before, right? Yeah, this frame was. This frame and this one. So the story on this bike, it originally came from a, a guy Johnson, and he was like a pretty well-known two-stroke tuner for these bikes. And then my friend Peely bought it, and him and his friend uh, Suave were working on it, getting it going, and then he crashed it. That's the old frame. Crash. He said he bent the stem and possibly the frame on it. He said it got all tweaked up from the crash pretty bad. He was super drunk and crashed that shit. So then I sold him my frame and then put all that stuff on it. 
and I got it back. <laughs> now it's back. You did a full now circle. It's back. It belonged to a couple of like good friends that are no longer with us, so gotta keep it going, man. Sentimental shit right here. Yeah. Thing going. Japan headset on it. Yep. This needs to be cleaned up bad. Look how dirty this thing is. You can barely tell right now because it's lighting, but it's like caked. It's seen like two, three, two or three sandstorms. Like, yeah, like <laughs> it's like a couple of you months. see the difference in the color up there. Bikes falling over. Crucial. We're gonna get her back looking cherry. Quick throttle. The old bulky thing. Got the Jap grab bar. Yep. Need that. Need the kicker. Need the. <laughs> <laughs> Trevor's been asking me for one of these for so long now. I know, what the fuck? <laughs> Chuck grabs a Koso kicker, one Koso kicker with every buy. Mm -hmm. Yup. <laughs> and this one came with a bunch of parts because he got this one. He has more panels for this one, um, skirts, the battery cover, pretty much a whole nother bike except for a motor. Oh, I got battery covers too, so I might be able to sell some parts, might be selling yep. some parts here yep. soon. Jap tail light, V8 pipe, another Jap headset. Shell. Got another head. What's that head? Oh, uh, Corsa head. Corsa head. Seen better days. Corsa piston. 72 piston. Doubt. It's my old race seat. <laughs> my old race bucket. Jeez, son. More plastics, S plastics. Jap tail is. Stanley, it's original. Yep. Oh, Kimco, that's a Kimco piece right there. Dude, so that's yep. cool. Those are the old panels that came on the bike that yeah. I had. Spray painted like 10 times. Yeah. And this nasty seat. Nasty seat. It's it's a new cover. Got a cover on it. Ooh, oh, dusty shit, boy. son. All right, boys, we did. We picked up another Elite. Um, Chuck now has like four or five bikes. So, stocking up on them because they're getting hard to get, boys. Like, they are hard. And people DM me all the time and message me and like, hey, where can I buy an Elite? We just find them for sale on Facebook Marketplace or something like that. And you got to be on it. You just got to find them when they come up. There's no other way around it unless you want to pay top, top dollar for one. But what we got right here is some clear turn signals for up front. So, to get rid of this orange look here, boys. So, clear ones there. Also, these boys right there. I got the clear boys and I got a pair also for my other elite right here. So I had to get a pair for... Get your chrome hot boy nuts in the description down below. For sale on the Mop Boy site, you can get these spike nuts. And they also come with these rubber washers. That way they sit against your plastic so you don't scratch your plastics. Wow, I barely just caught my camera, that was insane. So things looking good. I put some plastic weld on the inside of here. This is where the headset plastic was cracked off when I got it. So I just wanted, there's a little hairline crack in there. So I plastic weld it with some JB weld. Letting that dry and then throw this back together. But I'm gonna go ahead and put the side markers in this bike now while I'm waiting. So, this bike's so mint. Look at all these yellow factory marks on it, on all the switches and everything. Just everything I undid was like, I think the first time it's ever been opened up. Cherry. All right, clears are on there. Clear little side markers on there. The stroker's over here taken apart, and uh, you'll see why in the next video to come. But. But I'm really debating on just throwing the 72 in this bike right now because I'm tired of waiting to get this thing fast. I, I was gonna port this 50 bore and try to make a little bit more power with the 50, but might just have to go straight to the 72 because I'm bugging for it. But that's gonna do it for this video. I'll see you guys in the next one.